As we continue to work the pieces and parts towards the whole, we now need to talk about our attack and our key concepts for our attack. When we attack, we want to make sure that we get a double arm lift up to the ball. So here we have Brittany Northcutt, senior outside hitter. She's going to show us some of these key concepts. So Britt, let's get a double arm lift. It's really important as we attack to make sure that both arms are lifted at the same time and eliminating any scoop type motions. We want to get both hands up high above the head, elbow high above the ear. From this position, we call this our frame. And it's really important to make sure that we use our footwork and our jump and continually get into a frame position so that as we swing three, through, we use the strength of our body instead of just our shoulder. So in our frame position, both hands are nice and high. As we start to torque our body and use our, the core of our body to bring our um, shoulder and elbow forward, we want to focus some really nice hand on ball contact. So as Britt comes forward, she's going to wrap her hand around the ball in a number of different follow throughs that we'll be working on here shortly. The first one is called our high snap. So we're in our frame position and as we pull through, our non-hitting arm comes down, we pull, and our attack arm comes forward and we snap at a very high position. We want to make sure that our contact is nice and high. A couple other different follow throughs include our cross body swing. In our cross body swing, Britt's going to stay in her um, frame position, bring her non-hitting arm down, and drop and swing across her body. She keeps her arm in line with her body as she follows through. This is a great shot as an outside hitter to come down the line on. Our next follow through is what we call our wrist away. So we, again, we continue to get into our frame position. As we start to torque our body, we have our hand on ball motion, and we finish with our thumb down. And so Britt will show us what our wrist away looks like a little bit faster. Okay. As we make this motion, if we're an outside hitter, is a great cross court shot. Again, we continue to keep our arm within our body line um, to keep our shoulder nice and safe. As we progress and we start to use our feet, it'll be very important to make sure that we get our feet to the ball so that we are always able to get into a frame position and have a nice high contact. 